Hello, my name is Coach Jillian and this is Coach Antonio. We are 60 Minute Kids Club Ambassadors and we challenge your school to be healthy and active in the Fall Challenge. As a member of the 60 Minute Kids Club, you have been tracking your healthy habits to possibly be the most active kid in your school, school in your province, and province in the country. We want to congratulate you on completing the Fall Challenge and let you know about the great job you did. Before we go any further though, we want to know one thing. Who here is enjoying being more active and healthy? Okay, awesome. That's what we're talking about. As a member of the 60 Minute Kids Club, we want to make sure that living healthy and active is fun. If you haven't signed up, it's not too late. You can still sign up today so you can be ready for your next school challenge. Make sure to sign up and show us how active you are. You have all done a great job in making your school a healthier and more active community. Remember to stay on track as a team. Encourage one another and work together. You have to stay on target, you have to be confident, and you have to be a leader. As a 60 Minute Kids Club challenger, you have been building five healthy habits. The first one is eating breakfast every day and choosing healthy food for meals and snacks. So some examples of healthy food to eat during the winter are things like homemade stews and soups. Legumes such as beans, like these, are also great for soups or chili for a tasty lunch. You can eat healthy foods such as spaghetti squash, like this one here. Once you've cooked this and you open it up, you can pull it out with a fork and it looks just like spaghetti. Other squashes, such as acorn squash or butternut squash, and so many other different varieties are also great ideas for meals in the winter. Another example of healthy foods are root vegetables, just like these ones here. So there's yams, sweet potatoes, parsnips, beets, and these can be roasted in the oven for a delicious dinner. All year round, eating things like leafy greens, such as kale or bok choy, romaine lettuce, and other varieties of leafy greens is very healthy and it will help keep you energized. The second healthy habit is getting 60 minutes of physical activity every day. Don't forget, physical activity isn't just organized sports. Winter activities like tobogganing, skating, skiing, and even shoveling snow are great ways to get your recommended amount of daily activity. Our goal is moderate to vigorous activities that get your heart rate up. The third healthy habit is hydration. Every time you're thirsty, you should stay hydrated by drinking water. Remember, over half the human body is comprised of water and we need to replenish it. So choose water over sugary beverages. The fourth is getting a good night's sleep. Remember, you want to recharge your batteries so you have energy and you can stay focused at school. And finally, the fifth healthy habit is decreasing your screen time to less than two hours per day. Remember, screen time includes TVs, movies, and video games. You can even make it a goal to have zero hours of screen time some days. So are you ready for your next 60 Minute Kids Club Challenge? Starting on January 15th, the 60 Minute Kids Club Winter Challenge officially kicks off. It is 60 days in duration, just like the Fall Challenge. Remember, Canada has some of the best winter activities to be healthy and active. Make the most of winter and together we can make Canadian children the healthiest in the world. So we're ready to go. Keep up the great work and make sure to join the 60 Minute Kids Club if you haven't yet and sign up online today. It's time to show us you're active. Everybody, stand on up. All right, that's it. Get nice and high. Okay, give yourself some space. Your first challenge starts today. Here we go. Our first movement is going to be a lunge. Right foot forward. Upright position, forward foot. Make sure the heel is nice and flat. Going up and down. Good job, everyone. Keep that up. Awesome work, don't stop yet. Okay, good. Now we're gonna switch left foot forward. All right, same thing, upright chest. Your heel is gonna be nice and flat. Good job, everybody, keep it going. Don't stop yet. That's it, we're getting active. All Solid right. work. Great work, next is quick feet. So on the spot, everybody, get their feet going as quick as you can. Make sure you're breathing in through your nose, out through your mouth. Faster and faster and faster. Keep it up, keep it up. And our last movement, we gotta change it up. Out, in, out, in. Good job. All right. All right, pick it up a little faster, a little faster. Let's finish strong. And 
Ooh, great job, nice work. Great job, everyone. Next, we're gonna check our heart rate. So we want to keep our wrist open, two fingers. We're gonna place it on the inside of our wrist. So, who here can feel their heart beat faster than it was before? Who here is warmer and breathing harder than they were before? I am. Great. That means we got active. Awesome work, everyone. Remember, you can learn fundamental movement skills by visiting the resources on our website with your parents or teachers. Boys and girls, let's work together to help you and your school be healthy and active. We will now pass it over to your 16-minute Kids Club school champion who will acknowledge the top 10 most active and healthy students. We can't wait to see you after the end of this challenge. Take care.